size to that airship. They're walking her out of the hangar now to make her debut as Queen of the Skies. She's 785 feet overall from bow to stern. The giant envelope holds 6,500,000 cubic feet of gas. That's a lot of helium. Look at the propellers on the side of the bag. They're the only part of the engines outside the covering. This is a new feat made possible because the Akron's bag is filled with non-inflammable gas. To push her huge hose through the air, the motors generate about 4,500 horsepower. These motors can be tilted in a 90 degree arc so they can push the ship straight or down as well head. There she goes, clear of the mooring mast, our first venture in Cloudland. The motors are merely idling now because her actual top speed is more than 80 miles an hour. The cruising radius rail giant is 11,500 miles, a distance equal to halfway around the world. Those four strips on the airship's bag, which look like windows, are water recovery condensers. They condense the moisture, which replaces the weight of used up gasoline. What a thrilling picture the great makes as she floats majestically through space. It's a sight no one will ever forget. Long may she cruise as a symbol of America's air power. Thank you.